extreme hunt at my target. Hopefully this time the new gimbal that I have makes it so that you don't feel like vomiting <laughs> while I go through this. Also, I don't know how the stream quality is going to be since I'm inside the store, <coughs> but we'll do our best. So let's start, I guess, in this aisle. Look at all the Jurassic Park stuff. I'm surprised they still have so much Jurassic Park stuff here, especially given that like the movie has been out, what, well over a year. <laughs> hey, Ridiculous Badger. Got some Pixar stuff. Zerg. Hey, spoiler alert. Zerg is Buzz from the future. Sorry if you guys didn't watch that movie already, but if you didn't, it's been a while, so. Hey, Michael's Review. How's everybody doing? Got the He-Man aisle. I'm, again, this is another thing that I'm surprised that they still have this stuff on the shelf. They're paying for shelf space here. <laughs> hey, TM. Thanks for the compliment. Star Wars stuff. Do you guys watch Mandalorian yet? I watched most of the new season episode this, today, but haven't been able to watch it all. Ooh, this is a big one. Yeah, I won't be spoiling that since that, I think, literally came out today. Yo, I mean, the season three stuff just started, so. Just came out today, I believe. Here is Avatar. I haven't watched this movie. My wife, my wife wants to watch it, but I don't think she realized it's like three and a half hours. <laughs> it's, I only tried to watch a little bit of the season one, uh, episode one from my lunch break. Uh, I don't think the whole season is out. I honestly don't know because um, I only started episode one very quickly. You guys are into wrestling. Here's the wrestling section here. AEW, Powerhouse Hobbs, Lance Archer. Adam Page. I don't know. I feel like he's so overrated. Oh, is this old school Chris Jericho? Corazon de Leon. Look how he look, look how young he looks. I was just listening to a YouTube video about how Chris Jericho is saying he doesn't think he'll ever go back to WWE and he's going to probably retire in AEW, which is crazy to think because, you know, he spent so much time there. He was the first undisputed champion and everything. Oh, they also announced today that this man bum, ba, dum, bum, will be at um, WrestleMania 39. He'll also be on Raw, I think, next week. I mean, they have a bunch of him. Um, but you're not going to be able to see him because he's John Cena. He's going to be wrestling Austin Theory. The head of the table. I'm really disappointed. We have a wrestling, ra wrestling ch uh, channel on my Discord server, and we talk about the head of the table, Sami Zayn a lot. I feel like where they're going with the storyline does not bode well. I feel like they're squandering the heat, the, the uh, opportunity that they had with Zayn. Hey, Primax. There's no figure in the John Cena box? Yeah, exactly, right? All right, well, let's, let's move on. We're getting to the... Uh, this... Come on, turn, turn. Sorry, I'm trying to figure out why this gimbal's not turning with me. Turn, turn. It's got a mind of its own. There we go. Some pop stuff. I know there's some big pop collectors out there. Oh, they have a judo master from, from Peacemaker. <laughs> I can't wait for that show to get back. What else have we got here? Oh, Mona Lisa? Oh, yeah. Don't be suspicious. Don't be suspicious. Don't be suspicious. Got some Beyblades. Some big Funko Pops down here. If you're into Pokemon. Munchlax. I don't even know who that is. And then, of course, they have Eevee. No one likes Plop Stuff Clinical. Come on. Let, let, let people live and collect what they like. Got some Beyblade stuff here. I feel like the, all this What If stuff is so old. 
Gundam, uh, we'll, hey, we'll get to the Gundam stuff. Um, there, it's in another section, so we'll get to that in a bit. But let's see here. We'll move past the Blade Blade and Marvel Legends stuff because it all seems pretty old. Yeah. Hey, Extra Zero, how's it going? What are you, what are you saying here? Pick, I have a time coming Friday from Ansa. I didn't cancel. If you want, I could send it to you. Ooh, maybe. If we don't find it here, we're actually getting towards the Transformers section. And I'm looking ahead. And I, I'm, I'm looking looking like we're probably not going to get it today. Look look, look at my Transformers section, man. Look how sad this is. We got one movie figure out here. Of course, it's Iron-Eyed. They don't even have, like, the six Leo Primes that were here last time. Uh, of course, they still have these sad Galvatrons. Oh, they do have one Leo Prime. He's hiding. We'll put him out front just because he deserves to be front and center. I, I sent mine to uh, T-Man to see if he wants to review it and and or keep it. Um, Earth Spark stuff. All of them are Twitch, so. Uh, yeah, uh, I don't know, I may pick you up on that. I'm supposed to get it from Eddie at Toy Dojo because if I, I'm not able to find it, he said he'd, he'd get one for me in my next box. But I'll let you know. Thanks, I appreciate it. Why didn't you cancel it, though? All right, let's go around this way. This is like the T-Man section with Fortnite. Oh, that swoop? You want to see the swoop? Where was it? There was, oh, this thing? The Buzzworthy one? This is the Buzzworthy Bumblebee swoop. I guess it combines. Where's the, where's his face? Oh, it's in his chest, I guess? <laughs> I don't know how this works. Oh, there we go. I don't know why they wouldn't have his face out. Or I guess maybe somebody stuck it in. Or I guess he combines. Oh, you found one to target? You're lucky. All right, yeah, I might I might take you up on that. I got to see when Eddie's getting his or if he already has his. So you got Dinobot Swoop and Bubblebee form into this monstrosity of a combiner, I guess. I will say I find these open box ones funny because literally every single one I see. Oh, actually, not this one. The heads always pop down like you can see with this Optimus. You can press the button to pop the head up. Yeah, they're just all Optimuses. All right. All right, back to the T-Man section. Ball, the baller. This definitely seems like something T-Man would get. Looks like the thing from uh, Jurassic World or whatever. Dominion? Jur yeah, Jurassic World. Let's see here. Uh... <laughs> Clinical says his game stop. Uh, my local game has a private joke that it involves turning the heads of Transformers backwards. Yeah, I mean... I guess, you know, they're just trying to not keep inventory. They're just trying to sell out now. Oh, here's some Mario movie stuff. I haven't seen this before, but I haven't really been looking for it. Looks pretty good. Looks kind of like the figure arts one, just a little bit bigger. 16 points of articulation. Realistic eyes. What does that mean? What does realistic eyes mean? Oh, yeah, they have depth. Huh. I guess that's pretty cool. We got Toad. I think he's voiced by uh, Keegan Michael Keane or something like that. From from uh, Key and Peel. Uh, oh, they got a number of these. With Full of Bill. Okay, just these two sets. Oh, T Man also told me that, um, you know, in the latest one of the latest trailers where they do the, you know, fake commercial for the Mario Brothers, um, the lady who's like, oh Mario, I'm gonna whatever, whatever it is. Uh, apparently, she was the voice of the princess from the old cartoon. 
uh, original with uh, Lou Alba Al Albano. Sonic stuff. Nobody cares about you, Sonic. He just looks so weird. Grab that Mario, it's hard to find. This thing? Are you really trying to make me buy this? Uh, 20 bucks? What is this? How much is this? Let's see how much it is. We'll, we'll take it just because I'm succumbing to peer pressure. Pokemon section. Sorry. Oh, random or spark prime over here. Excuse me. Here's the neck section. They always have so much stuff in this neck section. Oh, Aquaman. Oh no, this Flash Gordon. I look look like Aquaman because I, I thought it was the orange instead of red. Press the buttons. What buttons? Are you sure? Uh, I mean, it, the eyes do look good. They do have. I mean, it's hard to tell in this video, but they definitely have a lot of depth. But I, I mean, <sighs> we'll see. I'll grab it just because I'm also trying to add more content to the channel, as you can see here. But I don't I don't want to just start buying random stuff. Oh, is this Jujutsu Kaisen? I don't know. I don't I don't watch Jujutsu Kaisen. Ninja Turtle stuff. I used to love Metalhead. Ninja Turtle stuff. This got this has been around. Wing Nut and Screwloose have been here forever. Rat King and Vernon. Yeah, they, they just have an un oh, and the, they also have the neutrinos. I think we did. oh, they have Splinter and Baxter. I think it's the first time I've seen them. The Splinter looks good. The Baxter actually looks really good too. Baxter Stackman. And then they have Zack and Smash, who I barely remember Zack. I don't remember Smash at all. all right, let's put these back. Uh, all right, well, let's, let's head on over to the other section where people are talking about Gundams. We'll go over there. This Target used to have a lot of clearance stuff too, but I feel like they don't anymore. Oh, let's stop by the PSI. I'll just, hey, Princeton. This is live, Princeton. We're, we're going live. That's what the title says, live. So they actually have PS5s now, God of War. And, ooh, they actually have Switches in stock. Oh, the Metro Dread Amiibos. I was mentioning that I just borrowed that from T-Man and got it back. I just finished that in a couple days. I thought it was not that good, to be perfectly honest. I mean, it was, it was fine, but uh, the controls are trash. Like they had the most complex controller scheme known to man. All right, so we're going to like kind of the book section, movie section. That's where for some reason they have the collector spot. Hey, Actor. Uh, what did he say? I see what he did there with the additional depth. It's like Mario figures always looking at you from any angle. Yeah, yeah. Hey, Maddie, dentist. Those of me were just $14. I loved, you loved it? I, I mean, I liked it, but I thought the control scheme was god awful. Figurized Goku, Super Brawly. I haven't messed with any of these figures. They look okay, but I don't know. I just can't bring myself to buy them. Especially when I already have figure arts. Big One Piece fan, but these figures just look so garbage that I can't bring myself to buy any of these either. Naruto, Sakura, Sasuke. They don't have the Naruto, but they have some Ultimate Legends Naruto here. Oh, 
I got some of these from T-Man randomly. Oh, man, some people opening these up. This is actually how I got it from T-Man. T-Man sent me a couple of these, but for uh, My Hero Academia, when um, he sent me Dread. And I was like, what the F is this? He knows that I think MHA is overrated. Here's like the newer SH Figure Arts Naruto, the best selection with his Rasengan. Uh, we got Aang. The Last Airbender, still a great show. Oh, I haven't seen this before. Bandai Namco has a Mandalorian Boba Fett model kit. Oh, these look pretty good. Oh, oh they got Grogu too. Does he have like swappable heads or what is this? Four types of face parts and two types of ear parts. That's pretty cool. And you got his little baby carriage thing. Oh. They have Fett's ship. Biden live build? No, live builds. There's no way. Oh, they got the heavy arms. We saw that last time we were here. But these are actually pretty cool looking. This box looks really nice. It just has a nice look to it. Uh, I'm, I'm pretty tempted. Ooh, you can see Boba Fett's face. Head with or without the helmet can be recreated by exchanging parts. This actually looks good. Anybody actually build any of these? Sorry, I'm not even looking at my screen right now. So even if you guys were answering, let me see. Let me scroll back real quick and see. Do you look, do you people, uh, do people look at you weird while you're talking to your phone? Yeah, I don't care. <laughs> what, uh, I'm at uh, the Target in my hometown, Chantilly. Oh, here it is, this is Zabi that, <laughs> that TM Reviews did a review on and broke on him. <laughs> and <laughs> I, I don't know why you collect these. Like, this looks like absolute garbage to me. Like, it has very little surface detail, like barely any separation. Like, this just looks terrible to me. Like, why would you pay $40 for this when you can get, like, a model kit? I don't know. I, I think these look awful. I have not been interested in any of these. Oh. I just noticed somebody stole <laughs> stole Kong's hands. He has no hands. That's, or did they... Did they package it separately, maybe? Or in the bottom so that nobody would steal them? Oh. You got the Titan Tech Godzilla. He transforms? Since when did Drent Godzilla have rockets coming out of, <laughs> out of his eyes? And neck, apparently. And... <laughs> oh, look at this. Look at this Kong. <laughs> he gets sunglasses. Look at that. That's... That's awesome. He gets a sunglasses visor. <laughs> I need to see it. Come on, flip the head. Come on. Ah, oh, it won't let me flip the head. I wanted to see the. <laughs> I wanted to see the sunglasses. <laughs> that looks so cool. Jujutsu Kaisen. Oh, here's some more of the Mandalorian stuff. Uh, this is the Boba Fett Grogu and sh that ship. I was hoping to see the, I was hoping to see Mando. I mean, the blue, the blue and silver speaks to me more than Boba Fett's green and dirt <laughs> color. Let's see what else we got here. We got some classic superhero stuff, classic TV series. Batman with Adam West. We got some cool street style Leonardo. Who is this? Is this who's? Oh, this is from Nickelodeon. This actually looks good. One in four chance of getting what? What is the one in four chance? Limited. So you can get more limited edition versions of these. Yeah, this Michelangelo has a couple sets of... Oh, sorry, this Raphael. 
So he just has the red one. We didn't get a one in four chance one with the Letterman jacket or the cooler red leather jacket. Put these back. Oh, wait. I don't know where these go. Samurai Leo. What else we got? Oh. We got Sewer Surfing Mike. Um, they don't always have a lot of stuff here, but this this section is a mess. It's always a mess. Spider-Man No Way Home. Top of the Statue of Liberty. Oh, Rodan. We got some other stuff up here. This is just this is so organized. It just seems like more like overflow than anything else. And why is this top so big? Because it has a comic in it. That seems that seems uh, a little too much. A little overkill there. More pops down here. If you're into pops. Coach Beard. Daisy Duck. Oh, they got Abomination. Cameron from Miss Marvel. That show sucked. She-Hulk from She-Hulk. That show mostly sucked too. More of the NECA stuff here. Hey, Lil, how's it going? Some classic movie stuff. This is the kind of stuff that uh, True Star Screamer is into. If you guys haven't checked out his his Instagram page, he does some phenomenal photos. We also had him on Chatterday last year with Hard Return talking about photography and stuff like that. So he also has a new on on the Figure Action podcast on Thursdays. Well, actually on Tuesdays, um, he has a new new series they started up called Reaction. So Figure Reaction. So they have topics. I think the last one, first one, they had uh, Kato's. All right. Because of TM reviews, I'm going to go get this. What did you say? I take back what I said about Pick for Life. Mario figures are available at the Target app. See me to see. I was about to buy this. Good thing. Good thing I didn't listen to this man. I was just about to buy this. And I was going to be like, I'm signing off. going to buy this because of TM reviews. Good thing I didn't. I've read that where I would have walked out of the, there with this. I mean, it does look pretty cool. Uh, hey, I still function. We already actually took a look at the PS5. They have a one God of War bundle for the PS5. So let me just put this back. Um, I guess one, one last place we could look. This was not the aisle, was it? One last place we could look um, that I don't usually look at is the lego section but i know there are a lot of lego fans out there so let's just take a quick look they have some lego right here marvel stuff friend stuff city stuff Ooh, we got a big r2d2 oh is this the luke scene from mandalorian yeah. With the dark troopers. That was a badass scene for sure. The land speeder. I don't know what that is. Justifier, is that from Rogue One? I'm guessing. I don't know. I don't know what that's from. Oh, maybe it's. Oh, it has Cad Bane, so maybe it's from Mandalorian. Harry Potter stuff. Uh, went to the Wizarding World of Harry Potter at Universal Studios not that long ago. Last year, last December. Um, none of my kids are really into that and I've never read them, but it was still cool to see. And then they had that kind of like 3D ride kind of thing. The Whomping Tree, right? Yeah, the Whomping Willow, sorry. Again, I'm not a Harry Potter fan. What is this weird panda thing? A Minecraft panda? Man, they got a lot of Harry Potter stuff. Um, in rumor news about Lego, uh, they're having a bunch of like cease and desist actions from Lego on uh, fan builds of uh, Legend of Zelda, like Breath of the Wild. So it seems like it's only, <laughs> hey, three live stream. 
it seems like it's only um, it's only a matter of time before there's an official Legend of Zelda kit from Lego, just like with Mario here. Uh, hey, Alan, how's it going? Alan Harvey's the local. Did you take a look at what Mario plushies they have? What about the Lanky Box plushies? I don't, I don't know what those are, but I guess we can do a special trip for you. I haven't, haven't seen these before. These weird, like, human-like Lego. Oh, Ghost Rider! This is a really small head for a really big body. There's Namor. Baby Groot. The Milano. They just call it... They just call it the Guardian Ship? It's the Milano. The Quinjet. Alright, let's look at this side real quick. Ooh, this is a huge Pikachu. Scan to see movement. I cannot do that right now. There's Butterfree. Ch Ch Charmander. Uh, uh, yeah, Charmander. Oh, the three evolutions of Pikachu, Pichu, and Raichu. Huh, I didn't know that they did so much of this. Got some Halo stuff. How do you guys all feel about the fact that um, Ash will no longer be the main protagonist of Pokemon moving forward starting next year, I think? Although they just revealed that uh, there will be a, a new Pikachu called Captain Pikachu. He's not Ash's Pikachu, just a Pikachu. And uh, you can tell it's him, not him, because he wears a hat. And so that what is make that's what makes him Captain Pikachu. Flower stuff. I, I mean, this looks kind of cool, but I just don't know why people would buy that. Ooh, look at this train. Ash will be back. Of course, they'll be. He'll be back eventually. Ooh, the Atari computer. System. I guess not. Not a lot of people remember Atari fondly. There's four of these here, and they're huge. Fender Stratocaster. Some succulent more flowers. They have a lot of flowers. The Camaro Z28, the Grand, the Great Pyramid of Giza. All right. So Alan made a special request that we got to go look at some of the Mario plushies, Linky Box. I don't even know what those are. Alan, is this what you're talking about? I don't even know what Linky Box is. Mario plushies. It's Coraline. What is what is Linky Box? You gotta help me out, Alan. You got you to gotta help me out just a little bit, because I don't know what, like, it's, is this stuff it? And the big Sterilite thing is not even organized. Home Alone. Next to the Minecraft toys. Uh, I see no Minecraft toys here. I'm in, like, my weird NECA section. You will see yellow boxes. Yellow boxes. I, 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 I don't know what you're looking for. We'll we'll do another quick pan around Minecraft toys. Oh, here's the Minecraft toys. Here's the Mario. <laughs> Alias is down, down, left, up. Uh, lanky box? Yellow boxes. All right, well, this is the aisle you want, but I see no yellow boxes. Is it, is it bigger than a bread box? Help me out here a little bit. Is it bigger than a bread box? Hey, Deluxe, how's it going? <laughs> no Godzilla NECA? Uh, there were. We were at that section here. He said stop, but <laughs> there's there's a lag. Oh, here's Lanky Box right here. Boom. Is this what you wanted? It says Lanky Box stuffed animal, but there's no stuffed animals here. Unless this is it. Only a Target Paw Patrol. That's it, okay. All right, I'm, I'm with you here. This this is it. What do you, yeah, out of stock. Okay, well, <laughs> that was anticlimactic. We, we went hunting for lanky boxes just for you and there was nothing. All right, all, well, that was an uneventful hunt. Didn't get anything. Here's once again, since most of us are Transformers fans, here's once again, the Transformers section. Nothing really. To shout home about just the nest autobot ratchet is here just four of them 
all a bunch of twitches. People are sort of interested in this. No, I did not find Tarn. This is my sad Transformer section. All this Earth Spark stuff. One Leo Prime, that, and two Galvatrons, and the Fatimus Prime. Every time I see this figure, uh, Zoids, I don't think there are any Zoids here, or they would have been at the section that we were at at the end of the aisle, the collector's corner. But every time I see this, I think of T-Man short where he he goes, <laughs> Bubble Bay. <laughs> Fetch me the remote. <laughs> if you haven't seen that short from T-Man 970, check it out. It makes me laugh so hard. All right, that's going to be it for today, everyone. Hope you guys enjoyed the live stream toy hunt. We'll be doing more of these. Uh, other than that, uh, we'll talk to you next time. Have a good one, all.